Yes, yes. Hello. So we're here with James. Hi, everybody. And we're here <laughs> in our lonely, quiet studio. Because everyone is up at Valhalla. Because everyone's in on their Valhalla location. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> so we got something really cool in on trade. Um, Jenny, did you take a video of this before? Yes, we've seen previews. Okay, we've seen previews. So. But now it's fixed up. Now it's on a base. We have our wonderful Chaos War Mammoth here. Let me not drop him because this thing is a brick. And he's pokey. And, yeah, he's got lots of pokey bits that have stabbed me a few times in fixing him. And notice in the back here he uh, walked over some poor chap that decided he was going to decay on the battlefield. We took off the Chaos Marauders that were on here and we put some Chaos Warriors. These are magnetized. All four of them. And we got a, a nice drummer up here. Now one thing I had to do that I wasn't 100% happy with, I had to kind of turn him at an angle just so he would fit because of the Chaos Warrior's cape. Comes back and hits this and it's just annoying. But we also magnetized the entire thing. Dink. Magnetized points. Oh, and when you knock the guy, he falls off. But they, they like to hang upside down. <laughs> <laughs> And I tried to hide the magnets as much as possible, and obviously they got to get touched up and painted um, in some of the places where they got scraped up. But yeah, he's going to get a paint refurb too. This is only step one. Yeah, but he's looking awesome. And these tusks are absolutely massive. I had to uh, actually heat up and bend this one here because it was too far down when he was standing up. It was on three legs and the tusk that was supporting his weight. So he was too heavy for that, so it kept breaking. But this thing is awesome. If you can get one, you should, just because. And from my understanding, uh, in Storm of Magic, you can have that. Just <laughs> for nice. fun. Any race can have that. So take me home with you. <laughs> <laughs> Adopt <laughs> me. Isn't he, isn't he cute? Sweet yeah. puppy eyes. Oh, yeah. look at the adorable spiked helmet. I know, right? So there is one thing that I found quite disturbing, and that's the backside. I'm not quite <laughs> sure what they were going for with that, but there's a lot of things. Like he's got a nice chaos symbol, got the uh, the giant cyst mm, on his gaping leg. Gaping wounds. Yeah, gaping wounds are awesome. Wonderful cuts and stuff here, scrapes, little rub marks there where his skin is cracked open. Very nice and chaosy. I love his tusks. I love all the skull details on them. Oh, yeah. That's my favorite part. Can you imagine being the poor guy having to carve those into his tusks? I mean, I don't think I'd want that job. <laughs> <laughs> There's a, a constant ad for looking for ivory carver. <laughs> Must be okay with the occasional goring. Maybe that's why chaos is the way they are. That's why they keep going for more. Because they got to find more ivory carvers just to do this. <laughs> just saying. Anyway, hopefully you got some inspiration for today. Hey, hey, Blue Table fans. I'm here to show you some Dark Eldar. Not Space Marines today. Shocking, I know. All right, turn the camera. Look at these beauties. These are some uh, Scourge that have been painted up, and they've got this awesome toxic glowy bases. Oh, they're so gorgeous. Check out this one. Ah, let me drop it for you. Demon wings. And we've also got an Archon. Joe. I got caught on the camera. I'm sorry. So, hope you got your inspiration for the day. So, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but our uh, four cell gallery is slowly shrinking as we move things over to the currently four cell section. So, if there's something that you saw that you really liked in there, it's possible that we still have it. It's just in our currently for cell section. So, make sure that you check it, and new stuff's going up all the time. Also, one more thing to keep in mind, 
if you see something in our currently for sale section um, and you want it but you don't want to pay with PayPal you uh, just sh shoot us an email we'll pull it out of the gallery and you can pay us check money order um, trade so yeah just let us know and uh, we take all of the forms of payment that we take for regular armies so yeah thanks